Hello guys, today I'm taking you with me for a typical day in my life which is both productive and realistic and definitely filled with lots of healthy habits that can hopefully give you some motivation for your week. Just finished eating breakfast and now I'm reading. I just started my new book, which is Atomic Habits. I'm sure you've heard of it. I've had this book for a long time, honestly, and I've been just waiting to read it. So excited to finally be getting around to reading that. I've been really good, honestly, about reading and keeping up with my goal of reading 24 books this year, which is two books a month. And I made it through three chapters today, so that's good, a good start. And I'm definitely liking it so far. I love like self-help books kind of like this. So I've been reading one fiction and one nonfiction each month. So this is my nonfiction book of the month. I also use Notion. I go into my reading log and all the tips that I get from the book, I write them in there. So I think that's a good way to help me remember all the lessons I'm trying to remember. I think now I'm going to go clean up the house a little bit and then I'll get started on my work for the day because that's kind of my favorite order of doing things in the morning. to-do lists and kind of look at what I need to do for the day and I'll like work on my computer for a few hours so usually it's editing a video except today I'm filming so I don't have a video to edit. I also usually like to reply to emails in the morning. I also have some other random tasks that I need to do like apply for a passport, I need to do my taxes, I need to get my computer fixed, get my disposable camera developed so I kind of look every day and I figure out which things on this list can I work towards today. getting ready to go on a walk slash run. I've been doing this for maybe like two weeks. In the middle of the day before I eat lunch and stuff, I go for a walk and I also run for like half of the walk and I'll put a coat on top of this. I like doing this because it gets my body moving and then as soon as I come back from the walk, I do a workout. So it's like 30 to 40 minutes total of exercise and activity a day. It also gets me outside. It's really nice. It's a good way to break up the day. And I just put on some leggings. Love the color of these. I think they're so pretty. Here's a fit. I'll go for my walk in this outfit. And then when I get here and I'm all like hot and warm, I'll put on like a tank top and shorts or something really quick. And then I'll immediately go into the workout so that I'm still like super warm. All my muscles are warmed up and then I'm ready to start the workout.
lunch. I ate those vegetables with some tofu and beans that I already cooked the other day. It's six o'clock now and I feel like for like two or three hours I've been just on my computer which as I said is usually how I spend my days. <laughs> There's nothing really to film of it because it's literally just me like on the computer like it's not interesting to look at. So something else exciting is my boyfriend and I booked an Airbnb today for our anniversary trip. I'm really excited. It's going to be our three-year anniversary. For months we've been talking about going on this trip. It's literally just one state away. We're going to like a really pretty park but we're staying in a cute Airbnb. It's like a cabin and it's just going to be the coziest like cutest little trip. I'm really going to like make a cute little vlog of that because I can't wait to just be tucked away in a little cabin. It's a really pretty area, even though it's gonna be winter. Not really gonna be snow, so it's kind of just gonna be dead looking. It's still gonna be really pretty and really cute. We're gonna go on little hikes, play board games, watch movies. There's like a little fireplace, there's a hot tub. So I think it's gonna be super cute. Tonight I wanted to go to Target. I literally go to Target all the time, but there's these Colsey bralettes that I have been seeing on TikTok and like they're not online yet. And I really wanna go see if I can find them. And there's also this skirt that I've been really wanting. I also need a concealer from Target, so might do that. Oh my god, look at the moon. She's so beautiful. three shirts I picked to try on. This one's like dirty, but I really like the color and the shape. This one's kind of just a basic tank top, but I like the material and like the texture. And I really like the color of this one and I like the lace. Mm, I'm kind of thinking no for this one, oh, but like not quite right for my skin tone. This one is unfortunately a no. It is completely see-through. <laughs> Love this one and I knew I was going to. I really like neckline. It's a thick material. The color is like perfect for my skin tone. This is the only one I'm getting. <laughs> which was so much fun. It's literally my favorite thing ever. It's like our little girl time. It's so cute. I just changed into a little TJ set and I'm gonna give you a quick haul of what I got even though I kind of already showed you in those clips. From TJ Maxx, I got just this one shirt. I already said, but like I love the neckline of it. I like the color. It's like a soft cream color. It's really smooth material. And then we went to Target. I really wanted to go to Ulta, but they were closed by the time we were like out. So I'm just gonna go tomorrow or something. But they had one of the two things that I went looking for. They had the skirt. The other thing I really wanted was this Colsey bralette, like I said, but oh my gosh, I saw it. They didn't have it in my size. They only had two of them left and they were, neither of them were in my size and I was so sad, but sure they're gonna like come online or something soon. They're just, they're these beautiful little white. I don't even think I took a video of it because my phone died when I was in there. I didn't bring my camera, but they're like eyelet little bralette, but it kind of looks like a top, like it could be a top and I just feel like it's so perfect for spring. Anyways though, they had the skirts I wanted. So cute. I love little skirts like this. Honestly, I love wearing skirts and dresses and the skirt has the perfect cut to it. I love that it has shorts underneath, white, but it's not see-through. Wasn't super expensive. Then, this is so random, but I love like a good little cute bowl. I always eat, you know, smoothie bowls, yogurt bowls, fruit bowls. And I saw this beautiful bowl and it's pink. It has like a darker pink edge and it looks like a flower kind of. Just, I like that it's wide, but kind of shallow. And I just thought this was a beautiful shape of a bowl. Next, every time I've been going there, they have not had my Bioma moisturizers either of like the purple one or the pink one and they finally had the pink one when I went there so I got this one I really like Bioma's products I like that they are unscented they don't have fragrance they have pretty good clean ingredients so I got the gel moisturizer I just got two other things I bought a new concealer like two or three weeks ago I'll show it to you I guessed at the shade and it's way too light like 
not even like the right undertone I feel like this one was called light beige so weird because this is light beige as well but it's in the hydrating concealer and this one is darker for sure I don't know if you can even really tell on camera this was the shade I wanted to get so I got the hydrating concealer version of this I really like this concealer and I honestly think I like the hydrating one anyways better because this one is a little bit like it dries down really quickly and then this is like my favorite lip gloss ever I love that it's not sticky I've gone through like five of these but I'm completely out right now so I got the lifter gloss from me Maybelline. I got the shade Gummy Bear. It's really pretty. It's just like a nice pretty light pink. Now it's almost bedtime. I just have a little bit of laundry that I want to fold and then I'm going to get ready for bed. I also have a cup of tea. I love having like a nightly cup of tea. It's very soothing. So here is what I need to fold. One thing I love doing before bed is using shea butter and sometimes I like to take shea butter I'll also mix it with like sweet almond oil or some other kind of skin oils and just basically putting this all over my body. I alternate between doing this and using retinol body cream at night or like just doing a lot of body oil but I really like to basically slug my whole body <laughs> in something like I want my skin to be as moisturized as possible. I highly recommend trying this. <laughs> I literally moisturize my body three times a day like when I wake up after after I take a shower and when I go to bed <laughs> because I just feel like it's gonna help me maintain the nicest skin that I can possibly have. It's like 10 15 now I'm about to go to bed so I'm gonna wrap this video up but thank you so much for coming along with me today I really hope you enjoyed. This is honestly just like a typical day in my life like very realistic pretty much just like what I do on average on a daily basis. I also wanted to show you some ways that you can kind of implement healthy habits into your daily life so I hope you found it helpful. Thank you so much for watching comment this emoji if you watched all the way up until this point. I hope you have an amazing day and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys!